This is Deer Wolf, and we have another exciting match for you, Zeb Guinea versus Sausage Link. I am joined by Yunos. How's it going? Hey, I'm going all... Uh, 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 all right, off to a good start. I'm doing great. How are you? Oh, I'm doing just fine. We've got... uh, what can you tell me about these people? Who are we watching here? We are watching um, Zed Gebney and Sausage Link, which is the best kind of sausage, in my opinion. Um, no, it's, uh, I mean, what do we what do we know about Zeb? Zed, Zeb. He, he likes eggplants. I'm pretty sure that's his favorite uh, consumable object. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He does consume a lot of eggplant, and um, he also plays a lot of NES play action football. Still, I, th I think now two matches in a row, he's maintained that world record. So good for him. Really? Yeah. So we got a world record holder playing? Is, is that what you're saying here? That's what I'm saying. How did that happen? And if Sausage Link's ever won a single rando race, he probably holds the world record for that seed, too. He has won a race. Well, he beat Elendar in week one, I believe. He did. He actually had a good time. He had a 113-28. So that was, a, that was a good time, you know, the first week. Uh, oh, yeah. Seven. And then it looks like uh, some rough seeds for his next two. Yeah, let's Really see. rough. Ooh, 153. Good Lord. And Saber Saber spent like an hour 30. Bad. Yeah. Good God. And Malagord, two hours plus. Oh my god. Wow. I I don't even I don't even know. I don't even know. Those sound terrible. Uh, yeah, Zeb those sound the like they were uh some sort of the seed action right there. Yeah. What about this Zeb guy? Does he like play this game? You know, we're in the fourth week, but this is his first match, right? I think he had one week one, right? I seem to recall that. Well, he did get dunked on very hard, and I think that that put the disabled list for the next two weeks if I if I have my sources ah. uh, the source on that is Angry Larry he's a reliable chap he does know uh, a lot about Zeb he talks he about does. him all the time <laughs> tells him what he can eat and other things he can do with himself um, we do have a start screen here that's yeah. a start screen it's you know it's alright it could be a lot worse Oh, we've seen worse constantly in this, and so this is, you know, northeast corner, a, a long way from the southwest. Not going to want to have to, like, make two trips to the Deadwoods. That's not without a good take road or an early report. Yeah. And it's right near three Armo screens, really, so there's, you know, 60% chance that maybe, possibly, you'll get, like, an item. Yeah, like a book. That would be the best item to find under an armost, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Uh, can they get the first bomb? No for Zeb. That's always unfortunate, especially this start location. Zeb is flirting with danger here, though. Our container helped can... a little bit. Oh, yeah. That's always nice, certainly. Yeah, and, and since we have the white sword on the overworld cave, is now a two bomb upgrade for till the end of this week only. Oh, silver arrow. Okay. Well, you know, silver arrow that saves you money from buying an arrow. It doesn't really do anything. Nope. No. I mean, boat could be in nine. Yeah. Now, now they gotta find some bombs. I guess collecting money is a good, you know, gives you a good chance of getting some bombs. Yeah, 15 rupees. That's not bad. It's higher than average. There's the off chance I could actually afford bombs. You never know. Level 5. And we learned that 7 is somewhere back where they started. Which, uh, not kind of a priority for me. I don't know about you. Seven? Yeah, seven. No. Oh, I see. Yeah, Grumbles of the Lost Hills. No, definitely not. No, sir. Not until they were like, hey, there's a wand in there. I'm like, okay, fine. Yeah, then you're kind of forced. 
Uh, we got some Pulse Voice, we got some Tektites, we got a lot more Pulse Voice. Free key? Up there. Sass, you going to go pick that up this time? No, uh, I guess that's not on the list of important things to do right now. It is for Zed, we're going to grab that key. Yeah. Zed, the key guy, he's got his, his like, emotes a key, he's, he's known for the key thing. Well, keys are typically a little bit important. Uh, the old man wants two, though, and Zeb is not willing to part. Or one max bomb, which is, man, the thing about uh, giving up one of your max bombs like three minutes into the race. How many minutes into the race? Yeah. Uh, zero? I don't know. All right. We're at zero minutes, I think. These guys are breaking the space time continuum. We might be going backward in time. All right, Sassage does indeed get a key. <laughs> All right. We have a timer now. The timer is moving. <laughs> All right, we're we're advancing forward in time. Uh, we're gonna see another old man try to. You got two keys. Yeah, you want to come up right now? Mm, no, I no. wouldn't. Yeah, I wouldn't either. Yeah, no. Where, what's the position on that old man? Is he he's blocking like the? Uh... He's blocking the north two rooms and maybe a possibility of getting left without a ladder. Yeah. yeah. It would be kind of rude if that was actually required, but we'll see. Yeah, it's really early. Hey, look, a road. We like roads, but we also like looking at uh, ladder items of a red candle. That would be a big priority if you can actually find a ladder. South coast screen. Gonna try to get back into the hole. Both players I... fighting with the spawn directly on the hole and north of the other armos. Gotta check I... the item. No, 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 no. The item's already been found. Yeah. But, you know, it's open caves. Yep. Can't complain about those. They are open. He's got one more road to find as well. Like, last one. They're kind of mirroring each other here just a little bit. Yeah, they, they're very close. We don't know which one that is yet. It's, uh, are the hints indicative of anything? The, or the text? <sighs> I don't really think so. Like what they're saying there? Right. I don't think so. I could be wrong. Ooh. I know Dave once mentioned something about like something is mags. Like if this is heavy or something. Yeah. Yeah, so there's some clues that I think that were specific to Magical Sword Cave or just flavor text. Bombs are expensive. Zeb's found them at little vanilla level 5. Really cheap meat, really expensive bombs. I mean, it's right next to start, so you can scroll and buy them, but that is that is a hefty price. Yeah, he doesn't remotely have that right now. It's the kind of thing, maybe, if you're going to buy them, you save after you do it, maybe. Oh, definitely, especially when you want to check the entire northeast. It's four bombs. Just check them all. Tricking the darkness by clipping across the screen. So, medium secret of 34, which isn't even enough to buy four bombs, but, you know, it's two rupees close. It's, it's alright. Ooh. So, hints, he can save for hints close to start, but he's going to need, what was that, like 100 and... 145 or so rupees? <laughs> Check that <laughs> And the large secret is 53, so... Oh, my God. <laughs> that's, that's a little bit rough. Oh, and couldn't oh. save before uh, the door repair got him. No. Looks like he's going to go up, up, up the mountain. Not comfortable with the scrolling. Looks like. Zeb does find some money. Do you make three trips to the hint store at this point? Man. 
I might. If money's this bad, I, I might just do it. Yeah. How long I... do you think that takes? Wow, that's gonna that take it over a minute, right? Uh, getting this. Well, you don't have to scroll. You can walk down the ladder and do the oh, back right. and forth. So that's all right. It's just you have to get through the Octorok garbage, which I think yeah. Seb does have it down to one Octorok up there. So that's good. He does have eighty-two rupees. And he's just moving on. The chance of he's not even buying bombs. The chance of saving a lot, like one of those hints would say it was the bow or the ladder or the, the rod. Save a lot of time, maybe. 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 <laughs> arrows, one rupee short. I mean, you don't want to buy arrows when you have silvers, but still, it's kind of funny. Sassage sees the hints. Update continue. No sign of. Heading back there. Not, uh, not saving either. So just gonna go for it, I think. Well, there's our level 7. Yeah. Another 34. Zev's building up. He actually has enough now to buy all the hints in one go. To avoid the door repair that nobody wanted. We got our first Triforce. One room wow. into seven. Wow. <laughs> He's coming back in. <laughs> what else is in here? I mean, maybe you look a little bit. There might be some keys or something free, but sometimes you just gotta take what the seed gives you, I think. Free bam. Free bombs, yeah. Here Zeb goes for the hints. He's going for maybe it. He'll find out what's in seven. He very well might, or maybe we'll learn step over the water for a red candle. <laughs> step over the water for a raft. Raft is not required. Those would be some quality hints. Oh. Magic key you too. Magic key is useful. No, step over the water, reach the boomerang. Uh, well, it's not the coast item. Yeah. We, know, we know that. Oh, oh, so. oh. I thought we had the coast item there, but no, we got a boomerang and a power bracelet that are ladder block. Huh. Ladder might be a little bit important. I... We also learned that four is near the desert. That's always an interesting hint. Yeah, that that's kind of spreads a bit. You know, it could be a push block, could be a bomb, could be a candle, could just walk in. Uh, do you think that the more step over the water hints you find that obviously aren't the coast item, the more useful they become. It, it does kind of help out a little bit. Because not every level is going to have a ladder block, right? Right. Right? Right. I mean, sometimes I've seen seats with like four Triforces ladder block, but items? Especially if they're all garbage items, which, you know... Yeah. Those aren't exactly great. If you mix in a good item, then it kind of loses its value a little bit. And Seb somehow is, like, horribly rich. Yeah, he just found another 53. And he kept he found a series of 34s. So, you know, he could, he could do a lot yeah. of things. He, he was going to keep on checking all this free stuff, maybe find another hint shop, then... Maybe find some bombs, or, you know, I think the big thing right now that he'd like to find the over besides obviously level one or something like that. Um, oh, heart, yeah. Heart container. And bomb yeah. Rate. Maybe a bomb store? <laughs> yeah. Run into a bomb shop here would be nice. Before he gets to, you know, the dead wood, like, don't make him sweat on it. Go heart number five. And meanwhile, Heart Rock just had level four, so Sassage here is just kind of looking around. Got a key in the tea room. So far, it's been pretty tame. Steps down to a half heart on the overworld here, and he's he's far from starting. He didn't want to die right now. Yeah, this overworld, the enemy set here can kind of wear you down pretty easily. Road 
things aren't particularly close to Star, not one of them, so... Looking to buy a couple keys and get himself, I think, situated with everything that he might need to get to the magical key. Give himself that head start so he'll have a... He won't, he won't be, like, hitting a, a roadblock. Yeah. Before he finds it, yeah. And he won't have to, uh, not pick up money because he's at max. Item in level four. The bow. Oh. That kind of goes well with the silvers. Yeah, a little bit. That's, uh, that's really nice. Now what Sassage needs is some money to shoot those arrows. <laughs> yeah, that would kind of go well with the silver arrows there. See, he just picked up one arrow and he wants that one, but he can't. He needs to have to clip to get it. Shoot that guy. Yes, we got ten globals sitting on one. Yeah, he's he's doing well in four. Zeb's trying to be careful here. Sitting inside the edge of the screen. Oh, he's going to re reload it. Oh, he's not going to reload it. Dropping the three. Zeb could really use a level right now himself to just up a refill. Yeah, there is a lot of boomerangs flying around. Yep, and he hasn't found the bombs yet, so the southwest corners definitely has that low appeal. Yeah, that troll potential of, yeah, go down here, leave a spot behind, it's not important. Boom. Bomb shot. There you go. Right where you need it. Sometimes the game is very nice. Oh, there we go. There's. Did you know that there are fairies on this overworld who refill your health? Really? There are. I thought they were just empty lakes that you had to have a recorder for. If you bomb on that screen, do you find Magical Sword? Oh, Outlands reference. Get it. Wait, what reference? Outlands. Oh, I don't know that. You don't know Outlands? I what? Mean, I, I've only speedrun it, which skips so much. Oh, yeah. I, I yeah. have played through some, but I don't think I found the Magical Sword. Well, that's because you had a bomb on a screen where a fairy was. Yeah. <laughs> the game really, really does some unexpected things. It, it really does. It's a fun thing. <sighs> this four... No one likes like likes. They may like you, but... Mm. Seb's wandering around in level one. Found a lot of lag in this room here. He's pushed back the Lionel, dodging one sword. That guy's got a sword. No fake shot there. Up, oh, he's got the bullet time, and he's through. Oh man, that's right. a good shake. <laughs> now, did he uh, pick up an item in that double block room? No. I might have uh, bombed those Lionels when they're all like six together. Yeah, Lionels are really great. They group up very nicely. They're... They, they have do. the same. Um... They have the same uh, aggression mechanics as uh, gorillas do. And so when you're in the near the center of the screen, they will all come and group up in like one spot. There's no maybes about it, really. They want to be your friend. So, Sausage Link, uh, two Triforce lead. It's making some good work of this seed. Yeah, that bow and arrow. Just gonna yeah. help them go really fast. Zeb but get does have some overworld to look at. Yeah. Good. We're still uh, missing some stuff here. Zeb, Zeb will want to find something good out of here in order to try to keep it even. Otherwise, uh, Sassage could run away with the seed. And longer he's sitting on, you know, with bow and silver arrows, and Zeb's not. Um, and this is where Zeb ran into a lot of money, so Sassage about to load up his quiver. And that's, that is very good news. And having that silver arrow, you can shoot those orange gorillas, maybe load up on some bombs. Oh yeah, money's just starting to flow in. 34, 53. And this is a swordless seed. Swordless tournament. Uh, there's a Triforce. Yeah. He does. He's, 
Thank him. Thank him. Do I want to kill like all the wall masters again? No. Okay. Yep. Pop back in, go a different direction, maybe. Yeah. I mean, there was an open door south of him, so maybe there's something good there. Oh yeah, all the money. Okay, he's, he's loading up the bombs. Here he goes. Kind of group them up. They're a little bit out of center right now. You can see how they like to pile up. Uh, that's one. Let's get four here. Four, four is pretty good. Four just needs to hit this bomb. Does not want to miss. And look down. Maybe um, think about getting his count to nine. Um, maybe. That'd be a good move before he spends his last bomb. Whew. Oh, no. Not nine. Uh, but it is the item, so... You know, you get rewarded with a recorder, which isn't bad. He can record her back here at any point, and that's on the other side of the overworld, and that's pretty nice. Yeah, it is. And he does have a bomb shop right outside. And he still is flowing with money, so... But there's a floor item somewhere in this level. Gotta do some rope wrangling. Try to get as many as possible. And that number was two. See if we can get a little more than two this time. Nope. But slow and steady. They'll they'll burn eventually. This room's gonna have to drop at all. Oh, nice move. It had it dropped seven rupees, but well, you know he got money. Yeah. Oh, buddy. Oh, good lord. He's going. To <laughs> Get through while you can. Here's our triforce room. A ladder down here would be. No bombs for this room, so he's gonna. It's gonna be tricky to get through here. Yeah, hopefully, there's like a lot of ropes he can clear. Yeah, we'll have to. It's gotta be a little careful. Oh my god, that is sword. And that heart doesn't save you from a sword, but. Might be a little comforting. So the... Bomb upgrade at the. Yeah. Probably. Probably. The one we saw already. Probably the one we saw. It didn't have anything that I would identify as a magical sword flavor text either, so. Yeah. Seems probable. Here's a room that'll have a drop for sure, but can he. He doesn't have a bomb. Uh, he had even one bomb. There might be a chance, bomb, yeah. But that was zero, and he could be waiting for days. He's gonna try to get around the other side, which will probably take some bubble boosting. Uh, the bubbles are helping. He's, oh, he's really good. hugging them. All right. Hint. Ah. <laughs> Yokiero Taco Bell. Well, all right then. Uh, so Zeb, gonna... he could go buy bombs and go back to that room, but he's gonna go this way. I mean, he didn't see all of level one. There were some rooms to the left. Yeah he could get left. I don't know what all the ways were, but one of them was blocked by the Goma. One of them was definitely blocked by Goma, yeah. yeah not sure about the other. One, so. I don't know what that other door was. Definitely those rooms connect now unless... Now there's no unless to it. They all connect all the holes, all the walls. I mean, the thing with the uh, sausage link there has a bow and arrow, so that Goma, not an issue. Yeah. Just hasn't made his way down to the Deadwood yet. No, I think this is a. If if Zed uh, had four bombs right now, this situation where dying might save him a lot of time. Uh, he's just trying to burn that guy. Yeah, looking for the bombs. I, I wonder if he's just gonna go into the grave. Why not? Doesn't want to drop another 36 on bombs right now. He does know that the the upgrades this way, so I guess that's one thing. Yeah. He's and he is guaranteed it. Although he didn't get the hint 
Well, he might have gotten a hint, and I just didn't see. I mean, yeah, he did he clear might... that area. Yeah. I mean, I guess, you know, in his mind, he could just be taking a chance that it is the upgrade, which obviously has a lot of value. But it yeah. also could be that he understood that the hint might have suggested it wasn't the magical bombs. All right, Sass is back at the start. Did he take a, a death on the oval? Yeah, a little blue dark nut kind of got up in this business when he tried to leave the nettle one. Uh, Having six of those guys, yeah, it's kind of hard to get through the bridge. Yeah, I like the overworld and how sometimes this is, you get those places where it's like, okay, I'm going to be able to enter this place, but the chances of getting out seem slim. And having nasty enemies on the bridge outside level one is definitely a choice for that. Oh, so, yeah. Same with level two's ladder. It's just levers today, so that's not a problem. All right, here we go. Don't feed Ganon after midnight. All right, ten bombs, and whenever sausage link, uh, sausage link, sausage, sass, sassy sausage. I gotta say, uh, both of their names are a bit difficult to say sometimes. I think we got Zed over here. Zed. Uh, do you like being on one heart on that Arma screen? That, I don't know if there's much that I like less than that in Zelda 1 Rando. Is this screen like the winner for most kills, I would, it, I would think? It absolutely has to be. And part of that is due to the, the frequency of coming to the screen early to check for the item, but the other factor is that it is a difficult screen. It's tight. There's, the, there's one exit, it's one tile wide. <laughs> And you have to pop three armos. And they're pretty far from that exit. It's, yeah. It's a congested screen. So we're getting to see more of five. Haven't seen a Triforce, a compass, or item yet. No, but with the silver is now in a full quiver almost. It's nothing, it's gonna be going plenty fast. Now, granted, we haven't seen whiz robes much. Those are like the yeah. one, uh, what enemy? Yeah, try to bomb down. Yeah, here we go. Can we try to bomb down here. Good. Oh, ladder block, but then there's the Triforce. What do you do? <laughs> uh, well, yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, it's like, uh, what's the time walking back there? Yeah, I might have seconds. needed to take a convoluted path to get there anyway, so... Right. I might want to check these rooms to the south. Try to bomb, maybe. Yeah, let's see. i say walking... Or, like, maybe giving him two keys. Would set his keys to zero, which is definitely not something you want to do, but time-wise, I think it would have saved him 30 seconds in the present. So Alright. Yeah, no. With cute two keys, you gotta you gotta save those. You, you don't zero your keys out. Oh, everybody loves the pointless triple row room. Oh yeah, one shot pulls the voice. Is there anything that's sweeter than a one shot pulls voice? <laughs> How about a passage that goes right to the next room? Yeah, here we go up. I, the item here still has a chance to be blocked off by that other robber. Yeah, there's just that one more room down here on the left of the Triforce. Zeb's uh, poking in heaven, gonna see a very free Triforce here. Just kind of gotta mosey up and grab it. Easy game. Yeah, I guess the passage there was a diagonal one room. Yeah. Hey, Gibdo, what you doing up there? It's not getting him around the robber. Bomb refill. So, if, uh, it, you know, I think eventually that Gibdo would spawn on the bottom anyway, but if it didn't, 
and he clears out the room, then that Triforce will spawn either on the river or in the center of the room, so... There's n it wasn't gonna troll him or anything like that. Nah. He, he was gonna get it. So he gets his third Triforce, making some good time this seed. Zeb's one screen away from finding level 4. Yeah, and he, he wants that level. He doesn't know it, but he does. If he's gonna con key that or not con key, but that. Yeah, he's gonna glitch that key door out. Yeah, two keys, that's what you do. Yep. It takes about 15 seconds to do that particular one. He's gonna go to try to glitch out the bottom wall as well. No dice. Okay, it looks like the top rooms are going to be accessible in 5 through these uh, pulls voice. Or at least one of them is. So probably both are. Yeah. That looks like that. Game's going to give him the key to check it. Oh, look. Single block room. No enemies. Nope, it's the empty one. Yep. Free push. What you got? That's what you get. Eh, yeah. It's gonna take I mean, you, you know. You know. Yeah, it's so, like... fun thing. We haven't been ladder blocked yet, right? And we have hits for two ladder blocked items. Yeah. Alright, Zeb's bow. Could be nine, but... Zeb has bow, has silvers, has a good amount of money. So he's going to start speeding up here. Yeah, so we're 25 minutes in. Zeb's just found the bow that was two screens from where he started. He um, also found three. six. That, that's a level. Yeah. Right there on that river screen. Above one. Yep. Mm. Took it any road to get right next to it, I think. Yeah, that's good. Ladder block? Is he. Oh, that looks ladder blocked. He'd have to go north from start, which there's a key door. Which he could leave, go up, and then come back down. And the game would think he had entered through it, but. Oof, yeah. another key door. He's gonna afford it. Oh my god, he gets it. Oh, it, look at this. We got a ladder block, I think. Unless he can bomb right in that room, but I, I kind of doubt that he can, no. even if he could. That's still the It's idea. a Chevy, yeah. Okay. And he tried bombing south of start, and he couldn't. So this level is just hard ladder blocked. Well, that's... There's no way to get in. Yeah. That's... Based on, you know, if I, so let's say I've got two hints, right, that, about ladder blocks. Finding that one of them very likely... Uh, points to level six doesn't make me happy about those two hints because yeah. I would I would prefer to be able to say okay those two items are definitely an eight or definitely a nine like I want those two hints to point to the same level. I mean I wouldn't be a, averse to having a six and a seven that were ladder blocked, but no, that'd be fine too. Yeah. But unfortunately, our seven didn't appear that way. But no, that, I think that. There's a good chance that he can avoid digging for that item out of that level. Not that, not that we know how long it's going to take him to find the Triforce anyway. That's that's always the question. And who's to say we don't actually require a power bracelet? I think that was one of our ladder blocked items, right? It was. We're, we're missing levels, but we do have all of Death Mountain still. Yeah, I think nine, nine Death Mountain, or eight Death Mountain screens still. Gotta get a health refill, that's probably a good call. He's got a long track on the overworld ahead of him to get to new territory. Uh, Set bombing dark nuts. Yeah. Neither player's been to the southwest corner either. Uh, I don't think... Has anybody bombed out the other two screens on the south shore next to the warps? I believe so. And I know Zeb went back and bombed the southwest corner. He got some bombs and did that. That's right. Now 
uh, Zev's kind of poking around in five. See if he finds the lovely heart. Making Which, wings. You know, hearts aren't bad. There's still the magical sword bomb upgrade, which is plus two bombs and a bomb refill. Oh, we got nine on a river. There's two levels on river spots. That's kind of unusual. Yeah, there are only three river spots in the first quest overworld. Zeb going for that heart. And it would not surprise me to see him go south, knowing that the old man is blocking the last couple of rooms in the west. And he wants your stuff. We're not going to give him our stuff. No. Unless we find the magic key in too. In which case, <laughs> you want two keys? Sure. We could spare two. Fooled me, there weren't any keys at all. What is A minus two is still A. That is Zelda one randomizer math, I think. Or just Zelda one math in general, really. Alright, let's see. Zeb is in the Triforce room. So Sassage clearing this uh, spot over here first. Oh, well, that's unfriendly. <laughs> no, he's... <laughs> Gurias are ganging up on him. <laughs> he's pulled out the bow and arrow. I mean, wouldn't you? Yeah. I mean, at that point, they were kind of all up in his face. He's like, all right, fine. Well, if it comes to this, I guess we'll, let's do it. Yeah, and, well, he's not going to go back to the ferry at the moment. And he is going to find one here, so that's your health refill, really. Nice. And he's here with the bow and arrow, unlike Zeb, so he can get by that Goma and maybe find uh, that other room or clear out some of the rooms that Zeb did not. Yeah? What do you think our second item in one is? The knob. Ladder? <laughs> the knob. It could be. The thing. It's always so easy to find. Although, we've seen two... Sassage has had two disgusting seeds, which probably did not have an easy one. Uh, probably so. So, what are we, is it going to even out for him, or what are we talking about here? Uh, yeah. Or we'll just find a boomerang. You know, wooden one. It is one. Yeah, and it is the fluoride. Quarter pickup, though. Which is very nice. He's got a lot of drive forces. He's, granted, most of them are in the east, but yeah, he doesn't have ones yet. But he but he, he will. will. And fives isn't bad. It's right next to an any road, and there's an any road on Death Mountain, so that would be kind of a way to get up there. He, he, he doesn't have six tracks. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we're gonna need a ladder for that one. Oh! <laughs> Walks into the door, but the hand... <laughs> the hand was him. waiting. Takes him back to the two-yard line. I believe that's a safety plate. How's that work? Uh, I, I don't know uh, your crazy football rules. <laughs> I'm just making him up as a go. That sounds like an NES game. Zeb is hesitant to use the key. I think, well, oh, no. Can... We haven't found level 2 yet that has a magical key. We have not found it. It does look like Zeb's pretty much committing to digging this 7 a little bit. Yeah, we'll have to ask what that's about. I don't know how much... He hasn't used a key yet. I don't know what lo his level of commitment is. We're gonna, I guess, we'll find out as we go. But you want a boat? Sausage does not want the book. <laughs> he left it behind. 
That was, yeah, I didn't thought it, I thought he'd find something good. What room was it in? Um, uh, room in the north. So maybe Zeb saw it, or maybe it was a combat room that he wasn't prepared for, because yeah. he didn't have bombs. So. Zeb's been to that area for sure, but yeah, I, I don't know about clearing it. I do remember on his map that he had been up there. He had missed the left three-ish rooms or so. Right. But I think there might have been too much combat for him. Because he was just basically struggling to kill the rope room, so... Alright, so Zeb toots on this whistle, takes him to a faraway place, level 8 vanilla, which is level 5 now. He might be going to bomb. Which, you're missing levels. Gotta be somewhere. Alright. Yep, taking the road. There's a lot of density up here. And it does look like Zev kind of gave up on 7. I don't know if he just didn't want to spend resources on it. Yeah. Maybe he's I... just looking for something free. Yeah. I... That seems like what you'd expect the play to be, right? Yeah. Don't want That's to a don't common want to play. play. And we got our Triforce out of one. They are tied on Triforces. Zep made some good time there. Yeah, they're, they're exactly tied up on that stuff. Same items, same Tringles. Overworld. I think, I think Zeb's a little ahead on Overworld screens, but not by a lot. Yeah, Sausage has to do the Dead Woods, maybe some Grave Spots. Here's the Zeb finds two. Yep, this is what we wanted to find. Come on, immediate ladder block. Just for fun. Funsies. We're still missing level 8's location. And level 3? I, I appreciate the very free Triforce in 2 when you know that there's a magic key in it. So you're like, come on, game. Mm -hmm. You gotta force me to keep going in here just for a key? It's all the keys. It, in this case? Yeah. In this case, though, it's totally worth it. He's got so much left to do. Yeah, he really does. And your keys can go pretty quick. Probably found the old man. I mean, the old man room could be a hint that tells you something. It's always I'm, that. Yeah, if I find the old man room here, I'm still gonna, I'm gonna listen to him. He's not gonna try to rob you at this point. He's already seen two robbers, right? There it is. Hey. On the take floor, that key. done here. He's gonna go for the hint. Look at that. What a heads up play. Dongo dwells on Death Mountain. Wow, that is some quality information there. No, no dip. Well, at least two was quick. Well, J. Cooper was right. The hint was valuable for us. For laughs. <laughs> for mocking. That me. was pretty much the only value it had, yeah. So where are our other levels at? Yeah. Zeb's going to hit two more screens up here, and then he's got three screens in Central Death Mountain. Well, level 8, though, is right next door. Oh, I love when the levels decide to clump on West Death Mountain. He's going to pop on the left exit here. Or where, where is he starting? Oh, right, he doesn't need the exit because the door's on the right, obviously. There we go. Yeah. No ladder already finds a room of item. Could be in the middle. Item. Free stair. Maybe a ladder. Yep. There you go. Uh, I mean, so free. You've played a lot of rando. If you find like a, a staircase with an item in it, second room, and so you you know it fades in, you can't see the item yet. Are you already thinking it's the ladder? I mean, isn't How it always often, the ladder? The ladder gets because of the way that the the randomizer program fills and, and creates and procedurally generates the rando. If it has to, it moves items around so that the seed can be beaten. So, I 
suspect that the ladder gets moved into easier spots sometimes. Yeah, especially given that ladder is required for the seed. Right. And we know there's at least two ladder block stuff. Yeah. It we already knew been, about Goma, though. The, yeah. The seed could have been generated with the originally with the ladder in level 6, and the sanity check made it go, nope, gotta place it somewhere else. Uh, Sausage Link did East Death Mountain. Hasn't found level 3. Alright. But I think there might be one uh, West Death Mountain over there, to the right of 8. That there spot that you always save for last. The, yeah, the last spot you check in the game. Oh, yeah, always. Sometimes. I mean, you know, the last bomb spot you check in the game. Unless right before. The last, yeah, unless it's the southwest corner. What, what's another last bomb spot? You check the one that Sasuke Link's heading for. Forgotten right spot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a spot that can be the last. Yeah, I'd, quite often. Yeah, I've I've gone here last many times and that'd be the level. Like, wait a minute, hold on. <laughs> hey, blue wizards, what's up? That's that's uh, unpleasant. So we know that the passage stair in 8 goes to one room. Now on the plus side for uh, Zeb, he has the Triforce out of 2. So he can always record her back to get near 8 if he has uh, Blue Wizard of Bomb issues. That's <laughs> just like <laughs> it pops up a ladder. Oh, a bunch of blue darkness. He's gonna bomb. Oh man. And this guy's committed. Yeah. Oh, but it's another level. Well, I guess that's three. All right, rip the dream. Uh, so much for power bracelet. So much for raft. So much for recorder lake. I don't know that we saw recorder lake. I would have thought Zeb would have checked that though. Maybe he did. He did? Okay. Oh. Say, you... Hey, there's an item. Oh, oh, yeah. Was it a magical boomerang? Yeah, the magical boomerang. Yeah. I've got a hint. said, Toot not to save the princess. <laughs> I'd say to pull a can of beans. Well, if we're assuming that Six probably has Power Bracelet, then yeah, Wan's either going to be in this three, which we're going to find out what the item in three is, almost certainly. The other item hinted to be ladder block was what, a regular boomerang? Uh, I want to say it was, yeah, boomerang. There's a raft in three. Uh, um, hmm. We're not yeah. gonna say it, are we? Okay. Nah, nah, I'm good. So is this where you uh, reset and start over? <laughs> or do we have to fight the main handler first? <laughs> yeah. He's got three bombs. <laughs> Oh, he finds the Triforce. <laughs> Why couldn't the Triforce be there in first class? That would be convenient. Kind of. Oh, <laughs> it would be all kinds of convenient. <laughs> then then we'd be just going, you know, instead of whatever we talk about, oh, why can't we, you know, skip this or that, or like skip, you know, meat. would be like, why can't we skip the getting the raft, we don't even have to, we even have to do level 3. Uh, hmm. Sausage Link has to be careful with the bombs here. Down to 2, and he's got 2 overworld spots with 2 levels. Yeah. <laughs> Does have the recorder, so he can come back, but... Yeah, he never bombed this spot either, huh? He went up uh, the ladder first? Interesting. And he just lost 20 rupees, so... 
he has to buy his bombs, it's gonna cost him 36 arrows. Meanwhile, Zeb's down to 87 arrows. And that might sound like a lot. Oh! Oh. Sassage never got the bomb upgrade. Right. So he spent all his bombs looping back down here. Now he's gonna go check those last two spots. I like it. Seb is down to 71 arrows. Remember just a moment ago I said he was at 87 arrows. Uh, Lionel's take a, they take a shooting a little bit. Yeah, he's had some loaded rooms. Little does he know, if he just go to the little tail here, using silvers to kill keys. Right, and you now the red candle is on the coast. You, you, you wouldn't normally think about picking up a red candle this late, but there's no wand, and there, it's seeming increasingly likely that it's in level nine. Yeah, it's like nine or seven or. Like the strong choices, because six probably doesn't have it. I mean, maybe nine is just straight ladder blocks. Like one of those funny situations where you go one way and it's like an immediate Chevy. Right. Alright, ladder for Sassage. Ladder clip for Zeb. Hating it. There he goes. You can do it, buddy. Five arrows. Do the ladder clip dance. He's allergic to key doors, though, it looks like. Which is going to turn out in his favor. Is that picking up the raft? Doesn't he have. Sometimes you just uh, want a piece of wood, right? <laughs> there he wants a log. Is that what, oh, is he trying to do a meme? He's trying to get us to meme or something? He might. Okay. That might I, be a Zeb thing. Oh, uh, sorry, Zeb. You know, there there is a good point. I we have not seen the magical sword bomb upgrade anywhere. <laughs> yeah, we haven't. I don't know that you go sailing around looking for it. Granted, if you're broke, you can't afford bombs, and you've spent all your silver arrow money, maybe at that point you're like, well, hope and pray. Step back and eight. Did he never get the Triforce out of here? The tracker says it did not, and since that's as much... I well, remember. the tracker also says he doesn't have level 2 Triforce. No, that's wrong. Oh, dang it. Thought I could rely on that. Part of our job is to rest the tracker, right? Is, is that part of our job? Yes, we would not be doing our job if we didn't do that. Oh, yeah. He left 8 because of uh, what was in here. Some fun uh, blue wizard gone. party. Good enough. Gets the job done. Alright. Doesn't want to go right in that room. Wants to go right in this room instead. Okay. I guess he hasn't been to this room yeah. either. What's in there? Yeah. He's like just kind of looking around. Right. I mean, trying to hold off on the arrows, but you know, you're not going to reload a room over it, I guess. Could Zeb could have gone and picked up his red candle and tooted back here. He could. That's a, that is a valid play. I, I think we we do want to pay attention to that as the seed goes on. What his when he runs out of rupees? Because I'm I'm calling it now. It's going to be a win situation, not an if. Yeah. Uh, based on all this enemy stuff, he's going to run out. He's going to be shooting dig doggers. He's shooting everything. Yeah, shooting the fairies. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Why not? <laughs> Why not? Okay. Shoot everything. And 
It is. You know, the magical boomerang is in this level, and that could have helped with uh, the geese anyway. Yeah, it could have. It could have saved some money. You know, the red candle is the only option, I guess. All right. All right. So just had to take out three blue wizards and then just kind of wander to the correct room. Yeah. Top neck bolt. Fluffy uh, mane, whatever you want to call it. So I think the seed will probably come down to where in the world is the wand and how hard is it going to be to get? Yeah. Looks like Zeb's going to hit take any road. Uh, I guess this will be his red candle pickup. That's another way to, you know, to walk there. Uh, no, he's going to six. Yeah, he hasn't bombed this spot even. He's getting the bombs out. So he's still missing six. That's why I picked the raft. Yeah, that would make sense. All right. All right. Now he's right now down where six is. It's good to go. Yeah, sausage. Uh, having some fun bombing some blue wizards. Yeah, he has plenty of bombs. Let's just gonna take a moment here. They're not grouping up particularly well. No, sometimes they don't like each other. No, and it's not as if. They're not like dark nuts. They're not just gonna be like, "Oh, we're grouping up now." They don't have the same kind of movement mechanics. They'll continue to move in the same patterns over and over. So what you're saying is they're very annoying enemies. If you're trying to hide in the door, they are very annoying enemies. And if you're not trying to hide in the door, same. Why would you not try to hide in the door? Especially without a red ring. Another thing that we should point out is that red ring is yeah. probably in nine or seven. Yeah, we might not see that. I'm thinking nine. I'm thinking it's wand and red ring in nine. The so uh, as far as the hints go in the overworld, did we only ever see the one? No, I thought we saw. We only saw the one hint shop, yeah, the one that was over near Start. We haven't seen the other, so it's under a power bracelet or raft or... Yeah, those, those are our choices. Yeah, okay. All right, Sass is taking down... The, the Sass is going to save his money. Zeb's going to actually refill a little bit here on his cash with the Pulse Voice. He's down to 36, though. Um, yeah, Sass just gets by and he's gonna, got a free door to the right. Gonna walk into the Triforce room and grab it. And Zeb is looking for the item in six. Yeah. Did get the hints, but it's not gonna rely on them for saying, you know, this is probably a power bracelet or some other garbage. Right, it's not a guarantee. This could be the wand. It's just, you know, un it's likely that this is one of those ladder blocking items. I don't think we found Casuto this seat. Good old bomb upgrade, man. Oh, uh, what is this Triforcer that they never saw what it was? Hmm. Sausage grabs Triforce out of two. Does he go back for the magic key? That's, oh, right, that's the Chevy, Chevy room. room. Yeah. yeah, the Chevy room. Yeah. That would be why you wouldn't do it. And or even he, clear it to look. Yeah, he's Seb's gonna actually take the stairs, I think. That's how he's gonna get to the other part of the level. I think he's well committed now, and he's arrow clipping down to 31 rupees. Well, sometimes you just need that swag, and it's worth the rupee, right? Uh, yeah, <laughs> it really depends on the outcome. <laughs> Historically speaking. Well, if he gets to Ganon, and he misses his last rupee shot... Then we know. You always take two. So you can miss twice? Yeah. Alright, what do we get? Yep, there it is. Step over the water to reach the boomerang. Huzzah. Right, so now... And he snubs it. He, he doesn't care about it. No, nope, he can... Get through it. Who needs a repeatable damage that doesn't cost money? Not I. Um, he can put level six behind him. And I don't know. 
Level nine or seven. I. <laughs> which do you go? <laughs> I mean, I know which one I go because of that. Because of what I, what I keep saying about the over the water hit. That. Like, if. I, if they're, you know, two over the water hands, I'm gonna, like, think that it's pointing at eight or nine being early ladder block, but now he knows that it's not. He knows that six was one of the ladder blocked items, so now it, he's not gonna think, like, one of the items in nine is ladder blocked and the other's not. Like, that's not what you'd think, right? Uh, yeah, that would be a nine, hard sell. Nine I mean, they could both be ladder blocked. They could, you're right. There could be more ladder blocks. But there's, there are six pairs of stairs and nine. There are a lot of bomb walls. Going back to one. Yeah, back that's... Back to one to locate the book. <laughs> well, if you don't know the item in one, I think you do go back for it. Right. 27 I mean, rupees. 26 rupees. He's, he's getting a little bit poor. He might need to search for some to some wrath spots, look for some money. Yeah, he might need to get some Chumbawamba going here soon. Slight refill. Oh, that's good. That's good. Sausage Link. He knows where that red candle is. He's like, all right. Yeah. Not going to pass up on the free damage. Uh, level 9 could have like likes. Good. He might be going to the raft spot just to take a look. Maybe. That'd be cool. I'd like to see that. I think the viewers would like Ew. to see that. As far That's as a leaving, spot right outside the raft spot. Yeah, as far as leaving, though, get the <laughs> out. Come on. All right, here we go. We got a free lane. Woo! Try to Hotel it. California. <laughs> this is not a door repair that anybody wants. Ever. Well, you got two hearts. All right. Well, <laughs> Thank you, game, for making the decision for me. So oh, where's Zep going? Yeah, where is Zep going? going? Oh, he left money in, in a hole. That's right. He was maxed out when he was in this neighborhood. What's he got? He's like, he got I need money. Stashed away? He might. Oh, man. Zep's squirreling away some rupees. Who needs money making game? I do write down when I leave rupees behind sometimes. Oh yeah. Look at that, 15, even just 15 rupees here. 72, man. Is he gonna prove me wrong? He, he oh, might be listening, he's like, I'm not gonna run out of money, you know, so he'll show you. And I'm still not getting that red candle, cause... <laughs> he's two to the one, he's got the bomb shop right here. Okay, so he's gonna drop back down to 36. Well, that's definitely a way to spend your money. All right. Real he's quick. Outside level nine as well. So. Uh, he's gonna wander in, see what's going on in nine. Go time. Do 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 do. Only can so go. So what do you up? think? Linear nine. Whoa! Oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Well, this is... Wow, <laughs> do you have to bomb out of a lap locked nine to find a lawn, or do we have a power bracelet in here? I know! Oh, goodness! I want this to be Zelda right next to him, because that would be very amusing. Alas. Well, she could still be north of him. Alright, so what we're looking for here in level nine is... We're looking for the roar of Ganon. Heard it. <laughs> <laughs> the half of the Twinkie. I uh, haven't found it yet. I know. If I find it, I'm not telling you. I'm just going to eat it. That's the other name for the power bracelet, right? Half of a Twinkie? I, I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, is it the boomerang? I don't know. Oh, but okay, so Zelda's found. Okay. Hey, Ganon. <laughs> hey, Zelda. Um... You might want to find a wand, though. Yeah. What do you think? I mean, there's not an old man here who's going to tell you where to find it. Oh, you're not going to be able to clip from there. You, go. Oh, you can't clip. you got to reset it. There you go. He knows how to play the game, I think. Mm -hmm. 
All right. Well, let the let the staircase journey begin. Thought he was as you do. Time. Sorry. Yep. I get. He's gonna stay in here. He's gonna do staircases. That's cool. And it looks like yeah. he's gonna dig this level out too. Well, he doesn't have the compass, and I don't know that he cleared the uh, Chevy room yet. Yeah, he just didn't happen to go back through that room. But, he's continuing but the compass is right here. Alright, Patro, staircase he's not expected to get into logically yet. Think about that one. So does he ignore it? Or do he just be like, well... There's it probably connects to somewhere I can get anywhere. There's like a Maybe. bazillion paths in level 9s usually, though. It's like, oh man, what do I do? Clip well, it. you bump some walls and waste your bumps. Yeah. And then you just kind of give up and like, well, maybe this is like a red ring. Oh, pushes him out. As Patra does. Yeah, it could be. Alright, here we go. He's in. Huzzah. Staircases. The passage is... Gonna get the Triforce. Nope, still poking. Still peeking. Still prodding. Not an item room. Does have to take that staircase to go see the south of the level. Alright, Zeb is down to one bomb and 29 rupees. He will not be able... to buy more bombs. Assassin's gonna drop into the, just like Zeb, he's gonna go into these stairs. Continue. And as long as he goes north, it's an immediate item, so... And there's no reason for him to not, because the left wall is a bomb wall. Uh. Yep. He's definitely going up. He was thinking about bombing the wall, but he will not have to. Yeah, I wonder if he was like have a, having a little bit of a map check there to make sure that he was you know, where he thought he was. What am I, what am I supposed to do? Even uses the red candle to save that uh, silver arrow. Yep. And Zeb here, 20. I mean, he's swag pickup on a rupee. Shooting arrows at rupees, as you do. Uh, gotta do it. Trying to get us to meme. And a little shooting gallery on Sans to screen. Uh, he's gonna take the stairs back to the. Yeah, he's taking the stairs. It goes right north of the Triforce, I guess. He got some money from the Pole's voice anyway. Yeah. It's a, it's a it's a thing you can do. Kill for stealing our thunder. Uh oh. Uh oh. Thunder stolen. Thunder. Keep going. No, we're just kidding. Keep going. We're not gonna <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, not, I'm not doing not, it. So. We're, we're not doing a serious one, that's for sure. And we're not going to try to <laughs> rip off big shit. So, I mean, rip item. No, he's caps. the master. <laughs> They're dead. <laughs> Do you like how many rupees Zeb has? <laughs> I'm going to be right. <laughs> I love it when I'm right. He's got that. He's got that singular rupee. This this <laughs> is a long time coming. This is serendipity. This, what is the right word? This is a catharsis. Sausage is going into seven. Yeah, I mean, this could be the one. It very well could, and if it is, nine is free. <laughs> right, <laughs> it's like real free. Think about that one for a minute. But, uh, it was like, it was, uh, I don't know, two and a half years ago when Zeb handed me an upset in the first Zelda 1 randomizer tournament because I ran out of keys in level 9. And Have you been waiting for this moment, you know, a little bit? No, I, I mean, <laughs> I could play it up like I have, but I, you know. <laughs> Hey, but now compass. we're here. <laughs> I'm an opportunist. Yeah, he's, he's giving you the opportunity. That's. Oh man, 
he doesn't even he can't even clear this room. He doesn't have a red candle. <laughs> he's he's got nine bombs. That's something. Oh man, he has not found one item in nine yet. No. Nope. Not not even the red ring. Let's keep track of Sasta's progress. Still in the top half of level seven. Another item room for seven. Seven is huge. I yeah. Mean, look at this. This is like the a life cycle here. You know, you're born and you're helpless, and everybody has to help you live. And it's like the beginning of a Zelda randomizer scene. You've just got a blue candle. And that is, that's what he's back to now. He's in and level he's in, <laughs> he's and in the biggest dungeon. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, he's at the end of end of his uh, race's life, and he's back to just the blue can. Man. Interesting. Can't bomb south in those two rooms. So S Sausage is kind of checking out the map here. It's got to be some funny bomb wall situation, or uh, you got to take a staircase. There's one more bomb wall he could check, possibly. Up and eight for Sassage. He is committing to the seven, though. I mean, if you're gonna do it, you might as well commit. Yeah. It, it, there is definitely a finite amount of time that you can spend in seven. It's, you know, if there are 33 rooms, but you've got a full expectation that you can reach all the rooms, and if you can't, it proves exactly what you needed is that the wand is required. The only way that, that would happen is if he got blocked by a Gliok or a Patra, and have we even seen a Gliok all seed? I think there was a dark room that had one in it. Or I might be thinking of another seed. I don't know that we've actually seen a Gliok. I haven't seen one. I no, I think that was the seed I was playing. No. So yeah, maybe but Sausage needs to go south and bomb here, I believe. Well, oh, it's a key door. It just go through the door. That's cool. And left. Shutter door. Easy room. Bomb refill. Zeb's found more patch for action. You can go down here. Yeah, he's doing a good job of uh, doing a lot of nine exploration. For what he has. That's not like try to pop up, but not down. Got a staircase for Sassage blocked by a blue goma. I don't think this was ladder blocked, so we've got that going for it. Yeah. We might see right now the one pick up. Nope. Nope. Yeah. I mean, the odds were that it was going to be one of those. Might be required, but probably not, given that we've seen so much of Seven already. Oh god, hike it! He could have died! Yeah, blue land molas are no joke. They will wreck you. Back and forth we go. Sassage has... A lot of gomas in seven. Yeah. Sassage has four rooms left here. He's missed one room in the throw. That'll be the item room. <laughs> well, that's how it works out, right? You always full clear whatever level you're in. Yeah, this could be the passage stair. Could be the item. Down to a 50-50 now. It is. Oh! Well, well, well. Finds the sausage. He has the knob. And, uh... How long is Zeb gonna be in nine? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> he has two bombs and three arrows. And he has two arrows and one arrow. Oh my god. Is well... There, is there a reset coming in here soon? I mean, this is just disaster. Absolute disaster for Zeb. He's. Did you look at his pattern on his map? It's all over the place, really. It's like this batch. <laughs> it may, he'll just try to burn Dan and screw it, man. <laughs> Why not? Throw a boomerang at him. He didn't pick one up. 
We don't need repeatable weapons here, you know. Oh. We've got a blue candle, and that is enough for us. Just a blue candle and a lot of dreams. <laughs> Which one you want to buy? Woo! 54 or 54? Bomb. Very bomb drop. Oh, dude, the potions are 54 and 54? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, it's tied. <laughs> <laughs> but Sassage couldn't afford it. But he's gonna find Ganon immediately, so right. full health Ganon seems pretty okay. Yeah. Granted, it is that double river room with that river where you kind of want to stand, so that's kind of annoying. Yeah, but uh, he's got a free start if he goes right. Let's see. Oh, he's gonna go. He's going for corner strats. Yeah, this is what this room makes it a little more difficult to do in this room, but he looks okay here. It, oh man, Ganon was going right down him, but turned right onto the river. Ganon was actually oh, hugging the left. that's wall. some serious hugging going on there. there go. Got a stun lock. Keep it rolling. Keep swinging that thing. Ganon's down. Uh, we're gonna now. go up and then he's forced to left. Well, he didn't bomb left because he wasn't forced to, and that's the path Zeb took to see Zelda. Oh, right, right, right. All right. So we might be in for a little bit of a journey here for Sausage Link. Maybe. What do you think? Is this like an item behind Ganon? Oh, I hope so. Yeah, show us the item. Will the power race the red ring? Oh. That would be kind of... <laughs> well, right behind Ganon. As it should be. Boy, oh boy. So, do you think we might have seen a step over the water to reach the red ring hint had we found the other hidden shots? Uh, quite possibly. Yeah. So, if there. Or if we had found the other hint shops, we might have seen, seen like, uh, Gria grumbles with the wand. Right. That might have been helpful. Let's see, I don't think there's a reason to bomb out of this room, is there? Uh, no, not really. Just probably up A. And if he bombs left out of Ganon's room, that will serve him well. Oh, but he also has ups to take? Uh, eventually, yeah. He might want to save the bombs, maybe. Oh, he's gonna or try to bomb, bomb north. Here. That's yeah. kind of funny. I mean, it's not unexpected. It's Doesn't just kind work. of, it's gonna be a little bit... A little bit funny. Yeah, the compass was kind of in the middle of the map, too. Oh, buddy. Zeb fires his last arrow, misses the line, and walks into the sword. He has and zero rupees and one bomb. <laughs> take the long look at the continue screen and think, is it, I really want to make it say that? At a certain point, you're like, can my opponent just stop done, please? That's, that seems to be the point that he is at. I know that's the point. I'm, I'm thinking, if I ran myself, I, you know, out of bombs. And Someone stuff. end my mes yeah. misery here. Oh my god, just, just please. Please. Oh man, he's trying to use his blue candle to take out enemies. Oof. Rough seed. Yeah. This is a this is kind of like my nightmare. Besides the nightmare I had earlier where I like gained a lot of weight and like around my hips. That was weird. But um this is a different <laughs> kind of nightmare. Where... Just a little bit. This is like when you're uh like you're hip deep in water and you're trying to run. It's like there's no water, but that's what it feels like. It feels like you're trying to run in a swimming pool kind of nightmare. Right, and you just can't get it anywhere. Yeah. Running against the wind, I think the one way it's been put. Alright, he's gotta go for the good old Patrick kill. Seb is loading up. Zero rupees, one bomb, a lot of dreams. But those dreams lie in seven. Deep in seven, too. He might be recording back there. He gave. Give it a good shot. Sausage is kind of heading in the right direction now. A little bit. 
I even want to say this is compass around here somewhere, but he's not clearing rooms. But I think he's going to see a shadow door open here very soon. has a rupee. Yeah, and, you know, and he has a red candle. <laughs> Most importantly, for this level 9. Oh, not a red one. candle. Oh, yeah, that's kind of helpful. Yeah. Alright. Sausage is almost dead. But very close to where Zelda is. Oh, man. That's crazy. Don't- oh no! I think if he walked through that door... <laughs> Seb will not be denied. He's got nine bombs now, two rubies. We're gonna see what's at Vanilla 4! Show us bomb hey. upgrade! Oh. Can we find bomb upgrade? Uh, so get the power bracelet out of nine to get the bomb upgrade, I guess? He hit the. Oh, yeah, we saw the E spot, too. Did he toot? I guess he must have tooted seven. Yeah, he tooted seven. Uh, dang. Way back when. Dang. Yeah, we did see the forgotten spot. So that just kind of leaves Power Bracelet for the. Uh, I think Mag's Hint and the Mag's Bomb Upgrade are both Power Bracelet blocked, because I don't recall seeing either. Yep. I think Zeb might be committed to the idea of, you know what, Ganon is blocking the wand, because that would be funny. Yeah. Just gotta get through the bomb wall. I, mean, I think when Sassage gets around the finishing here, which will probably happen in the next minute, he might decide that that wasn't how it was, or maybe it was. I mean, at this point, anything could have been what it did it in for Zeb, right? And yeah. The, mismanagement of the resources or the checking of the wrong level. I mean, he... If Nine had had it, he would have a good lead. Unfortunately. Yeah. Just not the case. Sausage is doing a good job here of, uh, Clearing as much of nine as possible. Trying to get back to that one room that he's been in before. Should be old bomb left here. He even got some bombs encouraging you, saying, Go, go, guy. Now this is the room that he died in last time. Yeah, the unfortunate death. So he looks at his map, this is his only door left on his entire map. Here we go. So it's like. Go through there. Ah, that's, that's where you gotta go. Oh, so close. Before. Ow. There she is in a dark room. Gigi's out for Sassage Link, the winner of our race. This trial and ordeal for Zeb is over. Yes, Sausage has an official time of an hour 21.03. Gigi's. I couldn't even hear the recorder. Get what that song is. I'm sure it's something uh, that we've all heard a thousand times. I always seem to get repeats on these. <laughs> Seb is really, really committed in here. It's like, I don't care. We're, we're gonna dig out these items. If it's humanly possible. Do you think we can bomb right out of Ganon's room? Uh, no. Sassage tried bombing back into Ganon's room, but it didn't work. Oh, he did try to bomb there for no good reason, I guess. Sorry, I, I probably just gave it away that I was paying attention. You were paying attention to something other than Seb's rupee count, which is zero? Uh... Guilty. 
Yeah, Sausage wasn't doing the recorder uh, shuffle, so. And, uh, let's see. Zeb could, could clear out some Wallmasters to pad that root account a little bit. Do you use the word pad when somebody has zero of something and increases it? Or is pad generally reserved um, for when you have something already? I, I, would, I would assume that it's reserved for when you actually have something. It's more like he's getting rupees. He's just, like, scrounging for some rupees here. And going for... Oh, he immediately <laughs> goes back to zero rupees. Wow. <laughs> is he listening? He, 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 he dated that clock. This is a very scary room. <laughs> Still haven't seen the power bracelet is in this level. We didn't even get time to muse over. You mean you, you go from one to two rupees, you double your rupees, but zero to one. But do we even have a word for that? Uh, as far as a multiplicative term, you infinitely improves your. Rupee. You temporarily gained a rupee before you decided to spend it again. Oh man, now 11 rupees? That is so many silver arrows that I can throw into a Lionel. Or to pick up clocks or whatever random stuff he finds. Hey, thanks, buddy. Yeah. Do you think uh, Zeb is going to get both of the items out of here? Um, if he if he has the patience for it, I would say he's going to find what they are. Are you asking me if he's going to have the patience for it? I don't know if he's going to be able to. I He should be able to get the red ring. He's gonna have to backtrack and loop down to it. Ah, we found the croissant. He doesn't want to get it. Eat it. Come on, buddy. Oh, it could be the magic bomb upgrade. It could be the other half of the Twinkie. He does not want it. We never, we never got closure really on which is which. I mean, the Volvo 240 is the raft, right? Uh, probably. Maybe. I think it probably has to be. What else was there? The, I figure you have a the more a higher likelihood of remembering all there that. There was the 1990 uh, Frank Thomas Topps rookie card autographed by the big bird himself. There was a small dog. I do remember that. Yeah, a small dog. You do with a small dog, though. You wouldn't use that as a ladder. It's like a book. You keep it around just for company. Okay. Yeah. Good call. That's the book. Um. Got the heart. I'm sure that's something. Maybe that's the autograph. <laughs> How many rooms does Zeb have left? Other than everything like where the red ring is. I don't know. Zeb, could you pull up your menu for the next like minute so we can just count? There we go. Okay. Oh, I just saw like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think there are eight rooms left. I can close my eyes and picture it. Alright, buddy. Eight rooms. You can do this. Okay. Maybe. Got four bombs, so that's kind of... Does he assume Ganon is blocking some rooms? Nah, probably not. At this point, he's just gonna... get that whole nice picture... filled up for us. Silver time. Fifteen rupees. Zoom County, 20 rupees, he has to pick them up yet. You gotta pick them up before they count. There he goes. I see rupee 21. Ooh, 27. 
he's rich. For now. Alright. Sausage Link hear us. Yes, I get Hey, there he is. Good game. Hey, GG. Thank you. What did you think about that seed? Uh, well, I think it could have been a lot easier if I'd have decided to uh, dive seven earlier, but uh, all in all, it wasn't too. Yeah, I don't think anybody's gonna gonna fault you for not checking that seven for that long. Yeah, it was really deep, and you had to spend a lot of keys, which you had any key at that point, so it was kind of a moot point. But I'm pretty sure you're probably glad you didn't dig nine. That's what Seb's doing right now. Oh yeah, that's got to hurt right there. <laughs> it's it's starting to feel good. <laughs> it was hurting at first, but now it's just like just keep going. Yeah, hopefully eventually he gets out of there, gets back to seven. Yeah, we might have different hopes. <laughs> <laughs> I he found the power bracelet, and he should be able to get to the red ring if he just kind of. This guy has to loop backwards from the north to get back down there. And I think that might complete his level 9 map. Okay, that red ring was right in there at the beginning, too. Kind of surprised he hasn't... Oh, well, you went through the shutter door after beating Ganon. He can't do that. Oh, that's right. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah he hasn't been back to 7 yet. That's good. That's the picture here is that he's been digging nine for quite a while. Okay. Um, he's <laughs> he didn't pick up uh, any of the boomerangs. He didn't pick up the red candle even, you know, later on. Oh, well, here we go. He's found the red ring though. All right, let's go get it. See what he's got in his bag here. Gonna burn it a little bit. All right, he's got it. So he has one room left, it looks like. Yeah. yeah. All right, yeah, so. What were we saying? No. Well, now he's digging seven. <laughs> yeah, that's all he has left now, so it's just a, let's go through here. You, you kind of started off with the early lead, getting that bow out of four early. Seb spent a lot of the beginning without bombs, but when he did eventually get the bow, he kind of tied it up, and you guys were pretty tired for a while up on Death Mountain. Okay, yeah, he's he's a good runner when he can uh, get a little bit of steam going. He sure gets it. So, uh, yeah, thankfully I was able to... Yeah, he did, he did come charging back, but then he charged right on into nine, and... That's where he stayed. Gotcha. But you're two and two. How are you feeling about the tournament so far? I'm really surprised to be two and two. I never did any sword lifts before this. Uh, I got maybe a couple weeks of practice in before the tournament started, but uh, I've really been enjoying it. And uh, I know there's some really good competition going, so I don't feel like I'll be making it very far, but I am uh, feeling much better than I did a few weeks ago. Good. Nice. Yeah, this, uh, you've gone up against I mean, Saber, for one thing. That Was that your second round opponent? Uh, yeah, yes, yeah. that's correct. Good. Welcome. Yeah, it's like, welcome to the party, man. Here's your second round opponent, Saber. Yeah, I, uh... I have not had easy uh, Swiss rounds. Either uh, tournament I've been in, in the Pentaforce, I had uh, Dark Falls, uh, I had U Coper, uh, I was up against Fickman. It was just... I've, I've actually missed, you know, I, I haven't watched every single race of this tournament, obviously. Um, you had some, some wicked nasty times on the last two seeds. Were they really bad seeds? They were her end. I mean, they had to be. That's that was the only conclusion I could draw from the finish times. Yeah, last week's. Uh, I think a few other people tried playing the seed, and uh, they were even close to two hours on it. It was just. <laughs> All 
Oh no. Zev dies near the bottom of seven. Walks into a fireball. Uh, the red, red to bring death is the worst death. I think he was only a couple rooms away from the one. Yeah, he was. Then he's got a room. He's got a little bit of loose ends up here. He's trying to tie up before he goes back. Well, you gotta complete the whole map, right? Hey, why not? He finished Nine's map. Dragon and the Beast. Oh, just a just a nice casual stroll for Zeb now. It's gonna be really quick when he's done with this, I would hope. Yeah, he got the location. So, one thing that kind of worked briefly in Zeb's uh, favor is not having the wand to beat Ganon. Uh, took him basically instantly left, bombed out of Ganon left, and, you know, found Zelda's door, because he just kept going left. So he had Zelda and Ganon found within a couple minutes of being in level 9. He just decided to dig it out. It could have been yeah, very okay. fast. Yeah, the interesting thing is we never saw the second hint shop, which I guess at this point had to be power bracelet blocked along with the magical sword bomb upgrade and the magical sword hint. I want to say that's three of the four power bracelet spots. Did uh, both rough spots get... Yeah. Yep. Yeah, you checked the one and Zeb checked the other. I think that was... That was how we found that. It was kind of cool, but... Uh... I think you found the door repair, and what did Zeb find? We found a shop. Just a arrow shop. Taking out the Goma that got him for a little revenge there. Here we yeah. go. Here's a diamond. Fateful diamond. He's trying for the arrow. Swag clip gets it. It's nice. Hey, and he gets the magical rod. Had you purchased the hint sausage? I don't believe that I. Did you? Yeah, you think... saw him though. Yeah, I don't think you ever went back to get him. Yeah, I saw him. I I don't think I had any money when I got to him, and uh, just never. Yeah, Zeb bought him. Um, <laughs> they told us of a ladder block boomerang, a ladder blocks power bracelets. And, and uh, magic, magic key in two. two. Yeah. So for a while, we're speculating on which levels were the ladder blocked item levels. Which, you, know, you both dug out six. That was dumb. Yeah, that was one of those things where we're, we're as spectators, we're like, oh man, that's definitely going to be one of those ladder blocked items. But you didn't have the information. Alright, so Zeb's got his Ganon fight going. He's got the, it's all over the room here. Pick up Ganon in the middle. Yeah, Ganon's a little off from his normal spawn, but goodbye, Ganon. Here we go. Up an A refill for Zeb. He's heading straight to the finish. I that way Ganon gets, gets to live. Does he want to check out that one more room? Oh yeah, that means Ganon's going to be back in the room still, huh? Don't hug him three times, Zeb. Poised. Yeah, it's just a casual stroll. No Zelda room troll of, oh, you thought you were getting to Zelda, but you're not. Alright, Zeb's gonna finish this, maybe with 26 rupees. Let's see. Hey, he got money. Silver arrows. Bomber a little bit. Grayscale finish. All right. Uh, very nice. Finishes with the time of 1 hour 37.09. Does all the things. All of it. Tried to gamble for... Oh, 
rod and nine and doesn't doesn't turn out that way for him. I mean, it would have been neat to have to bomb out a cannon's room to get the wand, but alas, was not to be. And GG's to Zeb. Yep, finishes it out after what had to be a demoralizing uh, level 9. Yeah, that 9 was... If you wanted both items, you had to really commit to both items. Does look like Zeb will be heading on joining us. What's that say under the watermark? Mega Man 10? I can't read. The grayscale has made it so we can't see what the name of the song was. What's the song, Zeb? Mega Man 10? Is that all it says? I think so. I already quit out of it. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, that's okay. Well, good game, sorry. Yeah, GG. It, it was something. Good game to you, Sausage. Thank you, GGZ. Thank you. All right, so do we prepare any questions for Zeb? Um, how about that red candle? Just didn't want it? Yeah, I don't know why I didn't go and get it earlier. It was pretty stupid. Um, I don't know. What are you going to do? I don't know. I mean, you had money. I don't know, man. That was that was tough. Uh, if you're feeling down, I wouldn't go back and watch the video just right now. <laughs> yeah, I, I think um, yeah, that's all right. I um, I mean, it it, it, well, it was kind of funny that like, you know, I angry Larryed it and left nine when I saw the hint for the silver or elsewhere, and I'm like, ah, oh, I gotta go to seven, and I'm thinking, no, that's the wand, and then as soon as I thought realized that, um. You know, Satchel finishes. I'm like, all right, well, you might as I mean, that kind of sums it up, you know, playing, playing stupid there and like seals it right there. I mean, not that staying there would have won, done anything for me. I was, you know, obviously wasn't there anyway. I was actually making the right play. It's just uh, reading the hint wrong like an idiot. Yeah, another one. Um, Oh, it escapes me now, man. That how, just, how, it was such a brutal ending. How about that? Uh, that level one um, using the bubbles to get through, so I can see that there was a meat block. That was a hell of a move. That that was pretty nice. Yeah. I was, I, when that happened, I was like, "Oh, I'm on my game now. Yeah, uh, this is gonna be great." Yeah, guy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no one can stop me <laughs> except myself, and maybe just you know. Yeah. I mean, I, I shouldn't say it. Yeah, that's, that's, you know, it's not like, uh, it's not like, uh, you know, Sausage isn't a good player. I, I shouldn't, you know, I, I don't want to, you know, diminish his win. He had a, he had a, you know, put up a good time. So it's, no, you know, no, I, I just, no, I just, I, I, no, I just, I just like when that happened, I was like, oh, that was a good play. That That's what this is all about. Yep. No, that was a good play. There, there were good plays and. I just have crowded out every thought in my head. <laughs> but, you know, you guys, um, are you, are you, you both, I think, did a quick dig on seven. What, what's your question? I was just going to say, you are, you, are you uh, cake cat in this one? Kit cat? Or, or ca cat cake? Cat cake? Uh, what are we talking about? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing it right now. <laughs> That's how we started off. Nice. Or me, I should say me in one. Thurl's yeah. doing fine. What? I, I, was there a race that happened here? Huh? huh? What? What? Who? So, um, I, so I did only find one of the hints. Um, was was did were the other hints ever found, and were they helpful? We we believe they were power bracelet block. They weren't found. Okay, oh, I should have went and done that. What was your take on the hints then? What? How are you reading those very useful step over the water hints? Uh, well, I already knew that the red candle was on the coast, so um, I'm trying to think because 
what lo- five was the one that I went into twice. Um, but that wasn't that wasn't really no that what there was a ladder block there at one point. There was a way around it, but I was thinking, okay, maybe did I because the Triforce was yeah Triforce was way down there. So my first thought was, okay, maybe one of those items are in there. I think what were the two items? It was the boomerang and the power bracelet. It was a power bracelet. Okay, I wasn't even thinking nine really but with with getting that five block i thought okay one of those might be in there um i don't remember what other ones had ladder blocks that were is there a reason you decided not to go back to seven um i did consider going into seven at one point i don't did i go back i did go back in right for a couple of rooms and then just you did go back for a little bit yeah yeah, I th- I'm trying to remember why I left. I don't know if I got killed or if I was low on bombs or I just, you know, was like, I've had enough of this. This is a waste of time. Yeah, it was early enough and you, you appeared to be doing like, okay, I'm going to spend very little on, on doing this. I'm going to get what I can without dropping bombs or without using keys. Maybe, yeah, I think maybe it was pre time. any key, so maybe the key door is kind of drove you away at the time yeah i think at that point maybe you know what i might have been i might have been i'm trying to remember if i was low on bombs and then i had enough after being in there and said you know what i might as well just do death mountain because i think at that point i still had three levels to find maybe no four because six hadn't been found either and i thought might as well do death mountain i might have a, a level or two turns out i had three clustered um which of course yeah that got some uh some good stuff ladder key uh, the useful raft, the boomerang that you decided not to pick up. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't do that. It, was, it, was, it would have been great. Actually, it probably would have helped me a lot in nine with the stupid uh, Lynels. They were everywhere in there. Yeah, especially the blue ones. I kept. Yeah, it, it's a, it's such a bad feeling to go in there with. I don't know how much I went in there with quite a bit. Of, I, I left, got some, or before I even went in, I went and f- I had two secrets that I had marked because I was filled at the time. Went back, got it, I got up to like eighty, and then just drained the drained the account. Well, you bought a pack of bombs, so you oh, cut your money right. in half before going in. So You're you right. had like forty rupees. That's right. Okay, which was also um, quickly blown. Yeah, that was. Yeah. I think I'm good. Yeah, any further thoughts, you know? I think I think we probably covered uh, really everything of interest. Um, Sausage played a straight up, you know, really, really good, well measured seed. So I mean, we can't like be like, what about this move or that move? Because Sausage played a good game and. Yeah, he controlled his bomb. He, I don't think he ever really... You never really went low on bombs that I can really remember. That move... Kind of kept it up. Uh, the yeah, bombing out bombing out northwest and then getting the upgrade? Oh, yeah, yeah that was a really... Was Sorry, go ahead. Yeah, that was a really cool move where you kind of spent all your bombs in the Death Mountain, then went back and loaded back up on the upgrade to check those last two spots. Very nice. Thank you. Yeah, last week, uh, my seed against Malagord with how bad it was, I was constantly out of money, constantly out of bombs. So it was uh, being a little more cognizant of making sure to, you know, spare everything as well. That was a nice move. Yeah, good call. I mean... Yeah, resource management will kill you, so. Yes, it will. Well, I think that might do it. Let's, uh,